What's going on, everybody? Welcome out once again. B96, the Blue Cross Blue Shield performance stage. Please make some noise. She's going to be walking in stage right to Nashe. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, there oh, it is. Just, the big careful. running me. Be, be careful. Be careful. <laughs> Good to see you, girl. Hello. Hello. Take a seat. Get comfortable. How are you? Great. How are we you? heard that you were here in Chicago last night. Really? We heard because last minute. Oh, few, oh, you heard I was here last night. Yeah, <laughs> a, a, few, a few staff members met you last night, took some pictures and stuff. So oh, they're cool. Excited yeah, to see that's you again. Right. Yeah, yeah, All yeah. they did today was they walked in the studio. And they go, dude, you guys are interviewing her. <laughs> <laughs> right. What? Yes, it's gonna be it's gonna be dope. We uh, I had a little meet and greet yesterday, and you know the shows tonight. So I'm excited. At the House Very of Blues, cool. right? House of Blues. At the legendary Chicago House of Blues. Yes. Have you ever played the Chicago House of Blues before? I have not, oh. so this will be fun. Yeah, it's dope. It's dope. Yeah. I mean, actually, any House of Blues you've been in, it's kind of the same, but in Chicago, where it's cold. I mean, this is <laughs> this is going to be great. I can't wait. Yeah, awesome. Very awesome. cool. So, you know, we ask a lot of people this, uh, since you're not from Chicago. When you see Chicago either on your tour or you're, yeah. you're, you're going to be going there, what's the first thing that you usually think of when you think of our amazing city of Chicago? Um, I actually have a lot of family here, so I usually oh, cool. like, oh, you do? <laughs> yeah, I usually think of like my aunties, my cousins, <laughs> and you know they're all coming out to the show today. And like I got to hang out with some of them yesterday. So did you get like so. a home cooked meal then? I mean, it, no, no, we went out to dinner. Oh, <laughs> oh. <laughs> but yeah, um, yeah. So that's actually what I first think of. Then obviously the second thing I think of is the wonderful weather. The wonderful weather, right? And you're being sarcastic, I feel yeah, like, a little I mean, bit. That wonderful world, uh, wonderful word doesn't I mean, fit right there. I think. I'm <laughs> from LA, so I'm super spoiled. Like, yeah. I can't even take like 50 degrees. I'm like, oh my god, <laughs> <laughs> it's freezing. <laughs> <laughs> well, it was kind of cool actually doing some homework on you. Uh, I didn't realize that you were in a group called the Stunners back in the day. I was. And your group Throwback. actually opened up for Justin Bieber back in the day. TBT. Uh oh. Well, TBT. Uh -oh. Right. TBT. <laughs> Wait, it's not. It's Wednesday. I don't, I don't uh, know. Yeah, tomorrow. but it's, but uh, uh, we'll, we'll, we'll play this back tomorrow. <laughs> but you also opened up for Nicki Minaj. Now I gotta ask you, what was the difference in the crowd when you're looking at a Nicki Minaj audience compared a to a Bieber? Justin, definitely Bieber. different. Um, I well on the My World tour, he was like super popular right then. That was when he like still had like the hair, mm -hmm. and you know he was it was he was on like his first album I think like mm -hmm. Baby was like his right. hit single. Yo, those girls were crazy back then. They used to follow the bus. They would scream so loud. And how did like, they react to you guys oh, being girls death. opening up? How did they react to the They girls? were actually really nice. Really cool? Yeah, they were super cool, which is like different than I probably grown up girl, older girls mm -hmm. would be. But they were just like young and it was like the first concert they'd ever seen in their lives. They're just like, ah! <laughs> like anything is amazing. <laughs> And the crowd wasn't the same then for a Nicki Minaj show? No, but she has a really cool audience, too. It's a pretty diverse audience that she has, so mm -hmm. that was kind of cool. Are you trying to compare Believers versus Barbies? Are you trying to do that? Like, I'm, I'm trying, Let's start a Stan I'm, War I'm right, now. right now. Stan War. Everybody Stan on Moore. Twitter, go there right now and vote. <laughs> Who do you better? like better? No, just <laughs> <laughs> but then you also opened up for Katy Perry as well. I did. That was super dope. Yeah. Um, so I've got to open for a lot of really amazing artists. Yeah, I've been very lucky. And so now you're headlining your own show at the House of Blues. Yeah. It's pretty cool. Yeah. What's up now? Coming up in the world, Hell coming yeah. up. There you go, there you go. <laughs> I got it. Uh, also, reading up on you, I realized that uh, we share a couple of musical imp influences. Michael Jackson and Sade oh, are two yes. of the ones that you love. Do you have a favorite Sade song? Um, I have a few. Um, I like Sweetest Taboo. Love that song, absolutely. Classic. I mean, I have, a, I, have I like them all, so yeah, I yeah. can go on and She's on. so dope. Mm. You seen her concert before? In concert? Yeah. No, I haven't. I really want it's to. It's the weirdest concert because everybody sits down the whole show. So everyone's just super vibe down. Yeah. Like, hold your girl's hand or whatever. You just like, sit down. You it's don't. And then everyone's everybody goes but home. But everyone loves it. And then everybody loves goes it. home and they have sex. Yeah, that's, so that's, that's the that's whole like, point. So that's like, I mean, uh, what's I wrong mean, with that? You know what I mean? Like that is Sade what's Sade is, is responsible for a lot of babies. So do you want to go see Sade? <laughs> Let's be honest. Yeah. Yeah. You guys, you guys didn't get that. You didn't catch on. Oh, you got that. No, they got that. They didn't want to boo you in the middle of the interview. Let's talk about this though. I mean, every girl's fantasy. I'm sure every girl's dream is to maybe be a Mac makeup model. Yeah. And ladies and gentlemen, who's the new face of Mac right here? What is that? Yeah, I mean, why, why did you. they choose you? I don't under, I don't get, just kidding. I mean, this girl is flawless and beautiful. So <laughs> congratulations you. on thank that. You, That's thank awesome. Thank you. Yeah, it was really dope because not only did I get to, you know, be involved with that company, but I got to take a creative approach and, you know, creating my own makeup line. I created my eyeshadow palette. I got to pick out all the colors, design everything. So that was really cool. 
like to be I able can't to wait. Take that. I can't wait to uh, buy that. To wear it? Yes. <laughs> get it. March 15th. Hey, that's like, re- that's like that's, soon. That's, that's soon. That's, that's a couple weeks. That's yeah. Yeah. That's okay. awesome. okay. So you're going to be everywhere then, right? Because you're the face of it with a couple other girls? You're like, what's up? Yeah, no, I think you can get it. I don't know where it's going to be, but you, <laughs> you can get probably, it. Probably the Max one. That's what a spokesperson <laughs> is all about. <laughs> I, I don't know where you get it, but it's going to be great. You can probably get it. Probably. And online. I'm sure you can get it online. Yeah, absolutely. Of course. You can get everything. That's awesome. Let's talk about the new album. Yes, Joyride. Joyride. Round of applause for that the new album is going to be coming yeah. out I'm but so no excited. no release date yet no you know we like to keep people guessing yeah we like to keep them on their toes <laughs> are you uh, keeping them on their toes or is the album not done yet tiptoes the album is 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 virtually done virtually done it's like pretty much done. which means it's not done yet there's it's a couple more songs we gotta record and, which you know. means like you know there's just like fine-tuning things that need to happen very cool. before it comes out but i think the majority of the body of work is complete so i'm, I'm very excited and i want to also brag for you because you're you're People may not expect this, but when you left the the, the girl group, you mm. actually went out and bought tons of like production equipment and yeah. you like write and produce almost <laughs> all your own stuff. I mean, yeah. which is really impressive because Thank you. yeah, yeah. So that's really cool, like to have that that a part of you in this project and all your projects. Really. Definitely, I think it's really great and advantageous, especially as a young woman, to be able to create your own music and record your own music and like engineer yourself, produce for yourself. Because it's a very male-dominated industry already, and mm. it's just like nice to not be able to have to like rely on someone to do something for you. And yeah. It's that was girl power right there. That was like, yeah. <laughs> Hashtag it up, girl power right there. And speaking of girl power, you definitely have the power on the cover of Complex Magazine. Yes. If you've not seen cool. this cover, I wish we could have pulled it up on here. <laughs> we can. Ready? Nope. Can't do ah. it. Let me describe what she's wearing. <laughs> Underwear. Woohoo. So any guy in here, it's an amazing cover. Yeah, I mean, I'm wearing so like bright green like panties. Did you get to choose? <laughs> you say panties? <laughs> 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 do you get to choose? Like, do you walk in and they're like, oh, what am I going to be wearing? So this and they're is like, your this is your panty. And I this mean, is your bra. luckily, I already had the uh, concept before I got there, so it wasn't like a huge surprise. Like, it didn't like catch me off guard. Um, yeah, I knew that the concept involved something to do with like being in a water glass. So it was like, it was more swimsuit. It wasn't supposed to be underwear. Yeah, I was like, swimsuit, dude. Is, is it the same thing? No, exactly. <laughs> swimsuit's like for the water and underwear is for underwear after, for the underwear. Shot after the shot. Underwear. After the shot, right. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> and it had a lot of success here on B96 with the song player yes all right featuring chris brown yeah that was super great how did that uh, collaboration come together um well chris has always just been on my list of people that i wanted to work with and mm-hmm. you know he loved the record and and wanted to hop on it i was just like yes get on that yeah and when you happen when the song is called player who else do you have chris besides brown. Chris, I mean, brown, chris brown right is, i mean is, there you go hello <laughs> did you get to work with him in the studio or was this one of those things no where i like never work with people in the studio like all the collaborate prick Practically all the collaborations I've ever done have been like we send Virtual. Virtual. And doesn't that suck though? Like you don't get to like actually be a in the studio bit, with someone. But everyone has such crazy schedules. It's right. basically impossible. But you <laughs> know what? When people always say that, you could always make time, <laughs> right? Not really. I mean, I'm on the road for like the next three months. And like if he's on the road or yeah, for some, true. you know, Well, if like Chris Brown totally was smart, different. he would come to you. Oh, hell yeah. <laughs> oh, wait, it's totally different different Is your studio in your bedroom? I do, yeah. So guys can't come to the bedroom for wait, 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 wait. Uh, but your studio is in your bedroom? I do. I have a home studio in my bedroom. You yeah. can't have Chris Brown in the. Come on, man. You can't have him there. Chris Brown right now is well, coming to your house. Well, we can rent a studio for okay, that. Okay, 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 okay. Very cool. Do you want to sing for us today? I would love to sing for Do you. Do y'all want to see Tanache sing for us today? Yeah. Does anybody want to go in her bedroom to record music? Yeah. <laughs> All right, Chicago. Give it up for the beautiful and Thank talented you. Tanache. Yeah. Thank you. That was amazing. Thank Good job. You. Thank and the cool thing about that is, like, you know, the records on the radio sound a little different. It's stripped down like this, man. Really, really shows off your voice. That's Thank really, you. really cool. It's a different side of Absolutely. Things, you know? And how often do you get two on? You know. Uh-huh. I mean, uh-huh. from time to time. Uh-huh. It's a night in Chicago or no? I mean, it's going to be a great night. So if you come to the House of Blues after the show, you know it's going it's the down. Yes. Party. It's going down. Yes. <laughs> Chicago one more time for Tenace. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you, guys. And if you guys want pictures with her, please line up to the back door right over there. We'll do a little meet and greet real fast. Thank you. Yeah.